Bom, let's be honest, Parkias, Maris Parkias, Maris Parkias, and what the saddest Parkias, and today, what they are with, ah, you know, I mean, to work harder, the man has a try harder. J Prince, what's going on? How's going on, come on? And people, before I started, don't know, I'm going to bring up Ding. Ding, Ding.com. Bear in mind, I don't own Ding, just work for them every now and then. But what I can help you out with is a new code. Same 75%, it's LBH75. So that's Let's Be Honest, 75. And you get 75% off of your first order. J Prince, what's going on? Yeah, I'm not dead. Last time I see you, they had Jamaica and um, producer style you and be things. You all have heard them time ago. Lux. What's going on? What's going on? Long time the people now nah, see you. Well, we'll see you, you know, don't get me wrong, because we we'll see you do your, your construction videos and make, <laughs> you know? Your DIY and all them th things there. So, what go on? What, what J Prince are dealing with? We'll start this up. Well, basically, me just say my time now. Mm -hmm. You understand? Because you know, say how we do the motivation speech and we we'll say our time. So, we know our time now. So, it's like for the past few years, we just take some time out. You know, so we we'll focus on family, focus on, you know, ourselves. Mm -hmm. You understand? Because you know, music can be very draining. Mm -hmm. You understand? Especially when I try, I try to come up in it. So, just decide so we we'll take some time out and focus on our family. And we do that too. We circle ourselves now and we solidify a certain way with we choose self and we life. You understand? Family, everybody's stable. So we we'll say, all right, now music time. Mm. No, so we could go to the beginning. Mm -hmm. J Prince, upbringing, community, family, or the household is still. All right. Downtown Kingston, Spanglers, big up Spanglers, six lovely and to be ex mm -hmm. exact, 69 Church Street. Let me I answer mean, question, sorry, because yeah. mm -hmm. oh, 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 big is Spanglers? Because what they have a debate, I mean, I say, part of Anatom are Spanglers. No. No. So, what, what Spanglers? T tell me what governs Spanglers. That, that, what the border are they? Spanglers would be Mark Lane to like Rose Lane. Okay. Yeah, that would be from east to west. So wait, and it and it and um uh, that North Street side. Yeah, I talk for go up back, like to Fretchers Land side. No, like like you go more to Anaton and Denham Town side. Wait, wait, and you know the demography. I me never know. Me that me that think like North Street up there so because up there so like Anaton and them they are like different places. We don't consider that really a part of we. Okay, you understand? Okay, so okay. North Street and them they but from Mark Lane. Me would I say our Spanglers start from Church Street. Church Street, then Love Lane, then, you know, King Street, you know, all of them. Orange Street and then go Princess Street, all of them. Then go then, all the way to Rosie and Matches Lane, Beeson Street, all of them, they are Spanglers. You see me? And then growing up in a Spanglers and the hustle and bustle at downtown Kingston itself. Because, you know, you have the community and you have downtown Kingston where millions of people are traverse through every day what was that like what what environment it that? crazy yo, and it violent mm -hmm. that's one thing we can say you understand we have our fair share of violence in the streets to growing up in a spanglers you understand me have a brother lose him life don't they due to violence good brother yeah man my brother when me grow in our one house yeah man big up man and um grandmother get shot in a red back at a point in a spanglers uncle get shot up in a spanglers so that are really my upbringing in a Spanglers. Mm. When it come on to Spang, when me remember Spanglers, we remember violence. I mean, we got through enough. We have all the fun growing up, because you know, no matter how time did tough, everybody life growing up as a child, it's gonna be like Jai for yeah. the same way. Ball game, same Ball game, game whatever, whatever, marble, all of that. But at the end of the day, still violence, gunshot of fire every night. You know, you understand? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, violence. And then now the household, you lose a brother. Any more siblings in the house? All right, a five away, mommy get. You see me? So, yeah. Three sisters and two away as boy picked me. Okay. One room. That are the upbringing. One room. Me? One room. Two bed, one over your so, and one over your so. You understand? And the bed was like sponge. So, the bed a sponge, sponge, and you know, sometimes pallet board. Mm -hmm. Red floor. That's how we grew up, you see me? And then what about schooling? So go out and school named Amsbyal Primary out of East. And then after me left Amsbyal Primary, I go out and school named Daniel Quarry again out of East. Out of East, yeah. Above you. Mm-hmm. I go to Daniel Quarry till me about like 13. And then we'd have You know go. <laughs> <laughs> you know go. 
<laughs> yeah, is that is you that go to school? Yeah, well, very, true. very very short time. We spend at Daniel Quarry and then um, violence again make we have to left because we left town now and go castle town. Mm -hmm. Like we left town completely and go castle town. The whole family away because at that point, me tell us a grandma get shot, uncle get shot, all of that because our whole gang war activity. So we mm -hmm. just left town, continuous elsewhere. But that was that was my last schooling ever though. We never go to school after that. So, so, if you were adolescent, you just not go to school? No, I'm a hustle. Okay. We're a big man now. <laughs> we left school. We're so, 13, what, what, what hustle? I mean, when we go, when we go to Castleton and in place, they, you know, police will land and we bring you back to town. We'll leave a profile in, in the country because we're a ghetto youth and they say, Yo, when I get a youth and we just come down here. So, so like, I want to run from at the time. My brother have like five gunshots in his body. Mm -hmm. Like, whenever so I fly pass? through. Is that on a pass? Yeah, mm -hmm. in at the moment. There. That's the first No, No, I never have them shot there. I think he just have two shots in his foot at that time, because I get shot up more than one time. Mm -hmm. So, carry back a town, all the profile, and you got your all up in the country. Their country, little, little bit of sell like soup. One I time, they have friendship gap. I don't know if you know friendship gap around a um, junction. Mm. I sell soup out there, so. And at that time, I walk and sell CD from Castleton to all Devon Pen and them place there. And then, them things they never either work, because I'm a town man, you understand? Mm. So, loud that, go back to town, swallow field around my brother, chew man, chew stick. Formerly known uh, is a brother of mine that way, drop out same time. He used to their own junior gang, them, the ghetto youth crew, mm -hmm. he signed to them. Them time, they just come from America, I'm the American. Left country, go a swallow field around my brother. In space, I know time my brother drop out too. I'm doing this again. Brother get like 20 shots. With me in the house. Mm. Come outside, come around the doorway, come see him lay down. Full of gunshot. You understand? So that now we left me, left this and now go back at town. When we left this and go back at town. Go back at town, go back at Spanglers now? Go back at Spanglers. Mm -hmm. And the hustling was all kind of hustling. I mean, anything where you can think of, good like or bad. Eat. Good or bad of any ghetto you to the hustle and have to, and have to make it. We are on the road and I do the do. You understand and I come up. Yeah, man. So you need all that, that charm of it because the minute, minute thing you reach 18 yet, with all of this, like. No, nah, man, you know they 18. And these are, are actual blood relatives and they know, you know. Yeah, you go a country, you say you not to adapt to the country lifestyle, you go back to town and you say, look at no time. Your bro just gone, like, oh, you are, oh, you are deal with this, or you get so desensitized to it because you see other people are going to, this, like, you think this is normal at one point? I mean, get to life, make it tough, you know. Mm -hmm. You understand? That's why I'm not really knock it. Because at the end of the day, if I never eat, we would really firm in our earth, like how we firm in our earth, and even. Learn how to go place different places and add up and navigate life the way we navigate life. Even coming to America, uh, because we, we, we run with so much time, we, we move so much time, we change addresses so much time, so we learn, so we have to just adapt. So, yeah, we go back to Spanglers and realize that this is what it is. Whatever me I go through, don't they, me just have to accept it, me just have to face it. Because we have to eat, we have to live, we have to survive. So, so it's just you back as Spanglers or the family back as Spanglers? Me back as Spanglers. Okay. My brother come back as Spanglers too. We get immune to everything we're going around with negative. We just see the immune. It never matter at a point because of just the life we grew up in and how we live and that's what we have to do, what we have to do. You mm -hmm. see me? I don't know. Spanglers is a place where no people don't know is one of the column them in a, in a reggae music. Uh, Dennis Brown from Spanglers, right? Mm -hmm. And you have enough other arts and soul Only system. Just even just downtown itself, from Trenchtown goes straight back up. Like, what was that like? Knowing said them greats they followed from where you followed from, and then how, how the music, how, how the dance them go. Like, you get any inspiration from that? Not really, no, because when them did their spanglers, most are younger you. No, I'm not, I'm not even talk about them, of course, but I'm talk about like the atmosphere up. The music, because I must say, even studio, a bugger studio in downtown. No, me never really have focus, me, me really have focus on the tough life, the ghetto, the poverty. Just mm -hmm. like when we go to school, we never like school because when when me sit down in a school and teacher try to teach me, 
me, me I think about what I'm going to eat when I left here. Because so. I'm hungry like dog. I come here so hungry. So what I'm going to eat when I left here. So uh-huh. I what go on a yard, me I think about. You understand? I the same with Spanglers. Spang, all the Spanglers rough the same. So it's like, me, I focus on elevation. How uh-huh. I'm going to get myself out of this. Them, them up, up on um, b Street, Street, up, up at the studio, I do for them thing. We not focus on that as you would. Uh-huh. And when we get... When I come off age now, go around my brother, which is true man, true stick. Yeah. Him start bring me like a Bob Marley museum now. Me I see Damien Junior gang them. Me I see the Marley them and me I see them still there and all them set up and them thing there. I him really are the man where me see I do music and I say, you know, I say, me love music. So when him drop out now in 2009 is when me really say, yeah man, music is a thing when I feel like me I got to do that. Oh, okay. I really, him are the inspiration behind me and music. Spanglers never really have nothing to do with it. No, man, no, but Mr. Say, in terms of the people, I even Bojo, I think Bojo, Bojo is. Bojo. Yeah, man. Yeah. yeah, man, Bojo are Spanglers, man. Mm-hmm. Big up, Bojo. So, and again, condolences, bro, because I can't say enough, enough loss. Yeah, man. Is it me? Yeah, man. So, you feel like that, all them trauma there, you, you, you bring it back in uh, your music and your um, content? Yeah, sometimes. Mm-hmm. Because we live, we live and we learn, and basically, our way we got you, we have a project in our music. Mm-hmm. Unless we're just talented in a way if we really, you know, bring some different things to light, you know, even experiences from other people. But most, most of what me sing about, our me got you, and things we may try for other youths elevate from. My music right now is just about upliftment and, you know, elevation and try to work some different part and them something. There. You understand? Because we know, say, Better ways that they obviously based on how mm-hmm. we transcend and we put ourselves in a different energy and atmosphere. So, my music really come from that, but really me take from that to try to show people other ways and other directions. You see me? So, now, when, when music become a real thing, we understand that true man pass, right? Mm-hmm. Is that case where right after him passes, right, then master the studio, or it take a it gradually go to that point in the way it's all right, man. I start writing some song, I start recording myself. Like, what a process. I mean, I write, write song, you know, because Chow Man couldn't read, you know. Mm-hmm. So, Chow Man, my name, my middle name is Africa. So, Chow Man used to say, Africa, write this for me. While him would have sing the lyrics. So, I used to do that around him. So, I kind of this so it kick start from. You understand? So, when him drop out now, that was the only thing. We try every hustling already. Every hustling we get to you to do, you can't think of. We try. So it's like, we say, well, what can be the thing we're going to do now? We're go. And we look upon people like Bunty Killer, and we look upon Beanie Man, and all of the greats, them we do music, and I elevate them family. And you say, you know, I say, music, I feel like I'm going to do for real, elevate my family. I have a cousin in a swallow field named Andy. At the time, Gussie Clark studio across from right at Swallow Field, so. He'd have a youth name over Billy Z, Billy Clark, Gussie Clark's son. So, Andy said, Yo, me know Billy, you know, which is Gussie Clark's son. So, he mm-hmm. must say, Yo, them have a big studio over there, studio named Anka. I don't know if you know I that. Know Anka studio, yeah. So, he said, Yo, me, I'm going to bring it to Billy, you know. Billy supposed to be a vice here, you know. I said, Yeah. So, he bring me to Billy. Billy never really have the time for me, because at the end of the day, I don't really know nothing about music. Yeah, young artist. So, I'm a young artist. I come out the door this one and I sit down sometime and wait for Billy. You understand? They're in there with some bigger artists. We see them pass, we go in. Mm-hmm. You understand? We sit down outside, see them, and I wait for them. And, I mean, I, if, me can, if my memory can drag vividly, I think one time it actually get to go in there and go vice, but it, we never really not much. You understand? So, that was it, and I kind of left it, so I go back to town and hustle again until one day. I'm there at town, and because I have a juice care at town too, mm-hmm. when I did build up. So one time I did a hustle on a big tree, and I see a hombre come for shoot um, a video with Bugle. And when Bugle drop a song named Tears Around, and the hombre um, produced that. So I see him shoot the video, and I say, Yo, oh, you're a producer, and he say, Yeah. And I say, I can't, I can't sing to you, know. And he say, Hey, sing you now. I'm just start sing. I'm say, your body, no. Give me a number. Show a number for the G. And like, say, approximately a week time, they are the studio, HDX studio, on a vineyard town. I go up there. 
You understand? And this when I start doing my first, I me, me try to record my first song, and the man must say, Oh, you're half key you now. And don't come back until you learn music. Or if you learn, don't come back until you learn key. And I think, like, in a two week time or so, I go back there and I record my first song, Concrete Jungle, and drop it in a them time. It was about 2013, yeah. I think. I record my first song, Concrete Jungle. That drop with a video and thing. And you know, look at RE TV and around the place, it's a play play and thing. And I never really do much for me. Like 2014, um, we are Andrew them part ways, HDX Studios. And then left there so now, start work independently. I follow up around a Friends for Real studio, around a Thailand. All about the place, you know, we just I go around and see where it can work. Anybody give me a rhythm with vice with mm -hmm. them, any little thing go on, we just try to jump on a rhythm here and there. And um link up with a youth named Jagger from England. Big up yourself, Jagger. Um live MB music and you know, I not even remember how the connection make really. Cause sometimes, you know, me even remember. But link up with Jagger from England. And um right so I think kinda take a turn because Jagger now he start do a thing and he start work out with we, we voice a song named Triada, um a youth named Jovi, Billy Rhythm, Money Boy produce it. Before that we do who feels it knows it for friends for real, mm -hmm. that drop and that start play too. And then um when it a play upon the take time rhythm, you know the version song me used to hungry, yeah. who feels it knows it. The song never actually go out with the juggling, but me was one of the first people to revise upon it. But like my, I think my song did last or something, and then the song never go out with the juggling. So the energy, energy, the energy, energy kind of when, when it go, out, the, the rhythm kind of died down basically. I know say it died down, but you know say when a juggling drop, the juggling blast out. Mm -hmm. So. So the promotion. The promotion never get my song because my song drop as a single. Mm -hmm. Without the juggling, so even though it depends on the rhythm, like enough people, like even when I play my song, they say, I never know that they on the rhythm. So, anyway, that go on and thing, and I did the same way I work, um, their own friends for really, never really a team of people who I work with, but at the studio that when I go pay and vice, mm -hmm. you understand? They need to have money boy around there, need a independent producer where I hang out, they have Jovi, sorry, a Bill Beat around there and I do him thing. And um, one day, man, he come to me and say, yo, take a rhythm from Jovi, you know, you like it? And I did some of my that was like early 2016, my fine triada. So, so is triada, like the video, is it, is it like from Anchor Studio type of vibe? Like that's how they have reflect pun? A various things, okay. a various things, because maybe me jump, but all the things we got through, because... Like, one situation, when I can remember, when I never talk about that situation, you know, I feel like I talk about it. Um, the studio, they are toil. You know, at the time, we have big producers that come through toil, like DJ Frost, a couple more. Mm. You have a youth named Humble Kid with the Depp and Magnum Kings and Queen. At the time, I think you have Ayaktien, you have man like Alkaline, Movado, them man, they are par in them time. I never remember them time. Mm -hmm. And um, DJ Frost a pass through every minute and uh, he might work with the youth them from around uh, um, Friends for Real. So one day I did it and he come and say, I'm a Japanese you read him, you are this me a job. I'm a humble kid did it and he come from the corner and he start play the, the rhythm out time care. So humble kid now start chat sitting and me start chat sitting on the rhythm too. So like a, a collaborative vibe. Mm -hmm. So he must say, oh, this bad man, him start bus blank and rare, 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 and blah, blah. So the dog I say, all right, I can't go studio. And we'll go vice this. Not friends for real studio. Sean is a studio. So my family say, all right, Wednesday. Wednesday, me, 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 I bring a go studio and we'll go vice this. Yeah, humble kid line up, link up, and my father come grab him and we'll go studio. So I say, all right, boop. They there and I wait. Wednesday, shout him. I say, all right, I'll send a vehicle for you because I can't make it for forward for you. I send a vehicle, I humble kid link up. 
up I'm studio, uptown, up a Sean is a studio. When you oh. reach up I studio, I see Actian, um, Sean is a DJ Frost come out, come meet me when we walk in the studio. And um, when we reach in the studio, Frost I say, yeah, man, and Sean is a, this is the first me I meet Sean is a, um, first me I see Actian in a real life. And um, <laughs> Actian song did a play called Amy the Vice Pony, same rhythm. So, we got some boom now. Acti um, Frost I say, and them I go jump on the new rhythm, you know, and me I say, yeah, we excited about it, me I'm looking. You know, I go some boom now and play the rhythm and say, I wanna sing, so we start DJ the song. Acti and jump up and start, blow, blow, blow. Boss in blank, you see me? Mm -hmm. Sean is a said speed. And then me see Acti and touch. DJ Frost on his shoulder and get up and walk off. So what that mean? That mean follow me. Mm -hmm. May I say something to you? Then, him and DJ Frost come, go outside. Then me see, me no remember, me, me no remember really if it was Frost or it was Actian, but one of them come back in and shout Sean Izzle. So Sean Izzle get up and walk out now. So me a humble kid left back in his studio and we did it and we say, yo, I fuck up already, man. You get what I mean? Yeah, big producer. Big, big producer. Mm -hmm. Yo, one of our songs are going to be one I song them we are playing. And Ray. Anyway, like eight to ten minutes, um, three of them come back in the studio. I hear, um, I think it was Frost, Seth to Sean, as I say. So, what do you say? I've got to do a thing for your mother. <laughs> <laughs> and <laughs> Sean, as I say, yeah, man. I mean, I forgot my tip, man. And Frost say, um, it look like so we have to go. I forgot to do this another time. Mm -hmm. So I look around for humble kid like I say, oh, what is no? <laughs> we say we have to go do this another time. So we go so up now and we say, all right, no problem. You understand? Uh, them, they don't have to respect them thing or them. They man. Oh. Walk outside and act in there, do act in me to do and I say, oh, yeah, man, you know what I say. We don't to work with artists so we don't sign. You know, you know artists. So same time I think to myself, I never see acting in sign artists. So I start mentioning a youth the name Brico. You know Brico? The name sounds familiar. Yeah man. At the time I work with Brico and he must say, oh, yeah man, an artist named Brico. Man, that youth, they are really our youth, that our artist. I'm saying, alright. Focus right now. I'm saying, alright. So that has something where. I now go tell you say Acti and tell him say do vice me now. Mm -hmm. But once Acti and touch them and then get up and come out the narrative corruption change. Just start, yeah. So things like them there to me a corruption. Me no know the, 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 the fans them whoever in the comment section them can't tell you what them think about what me just explain or what they get from that. Cause me know me never hear him say no do it you know. But based for what me done when me just said to you and when me meet you out the door where you said to me. And, and the end result again. and the end result is different. And the end result, me never hear from Frost again. <laughs> I'm gonna say this. I can't tell you. I'm gonna say this. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna <laughs> say this. It's a public. So, so me never hear from Frost. So them can't tell you. Mm -hmm. So try harder now. When that song the forward, this so but I say we get really introduced to Jay Prince. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And then you now the message did good, the video did good, the concept, everything. Mm -hmm. What that song they do for you now? That song they make you well know me. That song they make anywhere me go, somebody say a J Prince that. But the only thing where that was, um, the team when we did run, never really understand the promotional aspect of thing. Mm -hmm. You understand? So yeah, we do the Jamaica promotion. You know, we go we go to UK, go do some show. We go to Canada, go do some show and thing. But at 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 the end of the day, what it really are going? How things was really promoted? For go on a bigger scale. Them nor me never really understand. So oh, it's okay. like the thing was kind of boxed in. So is that when you get a blessing, you're never really ready for, in a sense. We never understand what yeah. you do with it or how you deal with it or how far this track can actually go or nothing like that. Mm -hmm. You get what I say? So, yeah, we go, the, the other song faker to a friend, if you realize the video was a coming soon video and the ending a triad and it never dropped till like a year time. Mm -hmm. So the follow up never dropped until a year time. But remember, say the song got big man, you see and bold. 
post no, this no, song. No, but no, no, so the song is big. So big up, you see, boy. So I say, yo, so the momentum, you feel like you never use the momentum after a song there? No, no, because by then, the way of music promotion I go, it a change. Remember the artists, them in other time, they did a drop like rapid. Mm -hmm. We just drop Chayada and I promote Chayada. So I said to my people, say, Yo, we need to drop the next thing now. It was like... No, make this go on. No, man, time. we are thought that song the powerful, man. That song they alone can go and carry you and raise it, raise So Nothing else never either drop or even if something else drop, it never either get the right promotion mm -hmm. where it's supposed to get. So it's like, even up to to date, the only song people really know me for a Chayada. Yeah, but in my opinion, Chayada is my body song. Mm -hmm. But it had the most promoted song and it still never get enough promotion. So think about the song then behind it. Mm -hmm. Really nothing. You understand? And then now after that, I'm saying, we never see you, you capitalize on the momentum. What a period they feel like mentally. Because you get the song now. You get the song. I'm sure producers interested you now for Vice Guys. You don't know. I just, I just give them that, right? And then now it's Everybody like, reach out. Yeah, for find the second song now, and the second song now forward, or your management, how... Did I go to stress them time there? It's stressing for try to find another song? No. We we talented, you know. We sing song every single day. So, just like now, it is never about finding the song. It was about putting out the song the proper way, promoting the song, shooting videos when on time when video is supposed to be shot. Mm -hmm. So if me drop a if me drop a song now and the fans them start saying, yo, when I next song, when I next song, the inconsistency it of how me did I do things in a, at that point and it, it wasn't just based on me because I never I remember at the time me not on a food, you know, I know me I spend the money. Mm. You know? So me not get to choose when things happen, you know. So that was the problem. Me can I hear in the streets the whispers I say, what time you know, what time you know, look mm. how the streets are work, but I don't have control over when to drop the next mm. thing or how to drop the next thing. So it will look like a me lazy. Because it will never look like your team lazy or your team not do it. You know? So it will look like a me lazy. It will look like a me not work. You understand? So that is what reached me for a try. Oh, okay. I know America. When America get into the picture? America get into the picture. Um, Jagger bring me to England and do two things. And then they go and go down there. Um, Get few bookings at Canada. We go Canada same way, and um, but just go back to Jamaica and go apply for your visa, mm -hmm. normal visa. I'm go out there and then give me it. I'm just start come America. When me come America now, me decide say me want to try some other parts. You understand? Me want to explore some other avenues. Is that career wise? Career wise, mm -hmm. because. And I say music now go work for me, you know, but it look like say it now go work with working with people because the way my brain work, I want things to do on timing and for my timing and how it's supposed to get done. So it's like me I say, oh, you know, I'm not gonna do music until me can really have control over how me do the music and how it go. You understand? So yeah, we start try some other whole heap other things, brother. Whole heap other things. Whole heap things will come American. Put one in a whole heap of basket and get the thing up right. You understand? Okay, so your 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 mindset was more me I gotta get my owner capital so me can run my owner ship. Because anytime somebody has run it, I'll be a fucker them do, and then me I get me and get the lazy title and all of them something. So better me just can have the bread and do it. Myself. Not to blame them, you know. I know mm -hmm. that me I do, you know. Me not play the blame game, you know. What I'm showing you is that. When you are working with an up and coming management team, sometimes it just can be that them don't understand yet. It is a trial and error situation, mm -hmm. just like when you just learn how to deal with it. Your first relationship is never one of your best relationships, them. Because I only for trial and error. Mm -hmm. So I that it really I go on with me and them. You okay. understand? It never was that them nah do with them or them them just never even know what they're supposed to do. So about now, what with the management team there right now? Who is the management team now? We are work with all island promotions. Mm -hmm. You understand? Maxine, big up yourself. And um, the relationship, right? Mm -hmm. You understand? And we just start seeing we're fairly young in the business. But at the end of the day, you see from we can work and put the right energy and collaborative efforts in it. And we can see what's going on out there in the media. 
and decide say, all right, this is the road to take a this we see a man a this we go do. I think it will work. Okay. And you know, more ask you a question too. Like I mentioned about frost them and the actions them. Who are some artists and producers who you can see? You know, say we owe them dogs with call and check in or many look advice or I can send them a one song and them a say, you know, say half key or that melody or change a word. Who are some of them artists there? No, I am. So you not link with an artist? No. No link with no artist. Link with normal people. Hmm. No link well, with no well, well, why? But you know, artists link with artists. Just to even say, alright then, for make a, a, somebody with that ears there for ear a song before it even drop. I mean, producers. Mm. Yeah, them, them, them as well. Like Producer. industry players. Who are some industry players with, players with SEO? This year, big up for chance say, yo. That dog is a, yeah, I can link him on, or I can link she and she give me the advice, yeah, whether it's for a booking, whether it's for a stage show. Shadow, prison marketing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, big up Shadow. Big up Shadow. Um, fairly new still, but chemists. Chemists mm -hmm. are really, Dylan can't team. Um, oh, me really send my song them to answer, listen this. Cold case. Call me advice, all in me advice, me we have cold case on the phone, and me ask a cold case. Oh, this sound, and he say, yo, change a line there, and change a line there. And I really, him not help me write, you know. Yeah. But, BS Pan is a, is a man who have ears for the music, same way. And he say, yo, change a line, I think you could have go hard there, so. I really like normal people, we don't really have like people in the industry, because the industry corrupt, you know, brother. Mm -hmm. And we love everybody, and we see everybody out there, and love what they are doing, and I say we wouldn't want to work with them, but. With us, they over here, so I try to do it, brother. Because the industry, me, me get my fair share of what the industry is really like. You understand? And all of them can tell us, say, anybody at all, they reach out to me. I love and honor and gratitude. And when, when a time for work, me work with anybody, if I realize, we just do a song with an artist who are fairly new to the game. Pablo mm, YG. Pablo YG, yeah. When we see I get traction now. Because me been, me been see Pablo YG and I say, yo, him I want to youth them way. Yeah, that you time have something special about him, him different. Mm -hmm. So, me always I say, you are Pablo YG, me that work with me. Been a, um, we put a, put, put, um, put a pitch up on a post and we play one of them songs, like Richard and Richard, one of my favorite songs. Mm -hmm. like. So, different from Pablo YG, when we work with, already, we see man out there like Labas, them, man like, brother, I really that work with anybody. Mm -hmm. To be honest with you, because remember we're not on a team and we're not on a side where we chose, on a specific side. But Music, you understand? No, we're not on a, we're not on a team or a side where we dip on and nobody, but so we don't work with anybody out there where see we and love the thing. We would have just have to reach out, but I do a whole heap of reach out in the earlier part of my career and it never, it never manifests out to nothing. So at this present moment and time, I just tell myself so we are going and do it and Anybody link we are willing to work with, we work with them. But we not really, me not reach out. Yeah, yeah, you have to figure it out on your own right now. Right now. Uh, but P Pablo YG, what a link they make? I know since that dogs are always in the States too. Twin. Mm -hmm. Frost Twins, you know Frost Twins? No. Frost Twins, big up on the say. I don't know Frost Twins them, man. Big no, up man, on the say. Alanda? No, man, I yard you with them, man. I don't know them, man. No. You know YG. Them. You know them, man. They know them. them they're on, them been around a whole heap of artists okay. from back in. You know, Frost Twins, them from Andrew, them days, HDX Studio, them days. So big up on yourself. But them, um, we realize uh, Pablo, them in the States, and then we meet Frost Twins in the mall and we are rolling Bojo. And I say, Frost Twins, you're there, and you say, Yeah. Bojo, Bojo Banta. Bojo Banta. Yeah, he just said, That's casual, he said, Yo, I roll it, Bojo, like. <laughs> yeah, so. Oh, so that one year, I was still the MD yeah. Atlanta film show. Sure. Yeah, we had a role with Bojo. Okay. And them running to Bojo and Bojo big them up same time and then my sister Frostwin and them apart. So, like the next day, I showed Frostwin, because Frostwin been my bridging forever. I showed Frostwin and I say, yo, and do a song with the bad Jovi, you know, and then them reach out back and say, yeah, man, the dog, them rate a thing and rare, 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 man, book. And I want three, yeah. But you see, that was a reach out, though. Eh? That was a reach out, though. Yeah, it was a reach out, but as when me I tell you, a something like that, like a connection of a daddy. Okay, okay. Like, like a mutual. Like a mutual connection of where you say, you rate with thing too. When, when, we, when we really talk about you, where you say, you already rate with thing and 
Like law boss and them, man, we talk about them, man, they rate the thing. Mm-hmm. You understand? But so, we don't think nobody can hear, hear your songs and hear the talent and, and, tell, it, and tell themselves that you're not talented. Not being talented, another thing with me is more like, I'm not doing nothing right now musically. Oh, okay. I'm not. I'm not. Yeah, I'm not. So, you know, we, we, what the benefit for we on our yeah, side yeah, yeah. to work with him right now. Yes, so. yes, yes. And that is understandable. Everybody got your affairs of that way. You put in your work and you feel like, say, at this point in your career, you know, and do nothing when I benefit you. So, that is understandable. I know, like me, I'm not a man because of that. You understand me? Just tell myself, say, Prince, go on and work by yourself. That's when you emerge back. People just willing and ready for work. Mm-hmm. That is understandable. All right, 2024 going into 2025. What can I expect? The public song that they wrote to do it thing. We know say I put in way more promotion into that as well. What, what will I look for for the rest of the year and going into 2025? I only more thing, man. I only only uh, some things I'm not even more that talk about. You understand? Mm-hmm. Wally pa collaborations, Wally pa. Wally pa shows, Wally pa good energy. Everybody I go see Jay Prince now with the kind with the full consistency we wanna always wanna see. A time fit. We really put it, we, we have the songs them. Goals EP. We are looking for February for goals EP. Because mm-hmm. a full time now we drop an EP. So we are looking for February for goals EP when you can look out for that. I want to go see some singles, one and two singles, I drop, drop off it. So you know the first song are goals. So you can look out for that. Mm-hmm. And then now, if anybody wants to come change out them whole kitchen, I just <laughs> 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 me, was that actually the first you did that? I just said that for say it. I must say, we are getting to you. You do a very impressive job. I must say, I tell them I come from a downtown Kingston, you know, mm-hmm. lovely. You know. Now, frightened, we're frightened for your house, brother. Yeah. We see get to you, come by such a big, nice house, brother. I'm frightened, we're frightened for your house. So it, it's like, me call a man for do sitting, and he's like, me I tell myself, say, yo, this a man I take too long, you know, me I'll ask, man, yo, this a man, I'll come in and I'll look for any place. And when a man I go around, me I say, yo, this look like a something where if me just go up on YouTube and try to think probably it work. Mm-hmm. And I tell you, brother. But just go buy up my, my tools, them and materials, them and everything. We ask the people them over Home Depot and them place. Say, oh, how you think this do? And I'm going to give me two pointers. Why best board for this? Why best material? Which cutting tool for cut them tightly? And yeah. Mm-hmm. And the first thing me do, I do the tree in the front yard. I change out the tree in the front yard. I post that. I see people them just rush to it like, I mean, I say, damn. After that, now, I say, all right, I'm going to do my kitchen. I do my kitchen. You know, the same breath I do in my kitchen, tile the wall and everything. I change up, I light them and everything. I see hundreds of thousands of people, like, viral. I say, no, man, this is a thing where the people them love. I do my patio, I do my front yard. <laughs> And it just so, bring fun. So you incorporate that with the music too, not, not, not so the, the, the home renovation. It's like you be more active on social media. Home renovations are something where we love. First, we love the, the whole real estate thing. Mm-hmm. You understand? We love the whole... Um, if you incorporate the whole real estate thing is a thing where we really dream for do. See that? Maxine, um, home smart, you understand? Maxine Realtor, she really a bring winner the real estate thing. And it's a thing where me love. So that is something where I go do. I feel like I go, me have, have, have this. I don't want to give away my ideas, you know. But you know, I go see something with me and real estate, something where I go, I go have a whole attention. I don't think it I go even have nothing to do with music, but I go have a whole attention, just like the things that I do before, but on a bigger scale. Mm-hmm. Well. J Prince, don't know there. And what about the journey? I'm say bad artist, bad bad artist. I'm came see tell me say you may say that honestly a long time when I see the G from them lucky motor studio that I'm find big song. You see me? What would they you know? When people don't can find you know? When you can find me on IG, J Prince, J A E P R Y N S E. Friend friend type J A E P R Y N S E in anything. May I go pop up. Remember, I want to big up people like Big Zim. You understand? 
them you they am a GC you know, cool case. You understand? Richie take them from Toil. Richie take them on a G. You see me? Maxine said we. You understand? You all work, man. Taj. You know I'm a queen. I'm a big up my queen. Can't go nowhere and I big up my queen. You have to do that. You have to do that. You have to do that. I am man, I'm a queen, me there so man beat all like all I had them are foreign and there so I do this man. Taj man. I want to tell you say, honestly, based upon your circumstances, bro, we just there so I will have a quick reasoning. Trust me, I'm proud of you, bro. And trust me, the ads, the ads did against you for real. Yeah, man, I will ask you. It did man. against you for real. Anybody who watches the post, I didn't make a try harder. I did so try harder come from. Mm -hmm. I mean, so work harder. Let's be honest, we're gone.